And here, if you choose application operations, uh, the, the examples with system monitoring, but of course it runs with a, a job monitoring or whatever kind of monitoring. And uh, here, the default settings, you can see that uh, for third party components, we have our ticket system defined. So it will react to alerts in solution manager. Naturally, you don't have to uh, assign this on this top level. Um, you can also go to template level or per, per system you can uh, uh, assign this. And also maybe for specific alerts you don't want to uh, trigger our tool. Uh, this is very flexible, but this has to be done in standard solution manager customizing. We just deliver this uh, third party connector. So um, let's see if we have maybe any problems. Yeah. Okay, so also check service now. Yeah, here we have the three incidents that were uh, generated whenever uh, the alerts were raised. So here we have an alert for availability. Let's check what we have here. Again, you can maintain a mapping in SAP. Uh, so have your service now fields like urgency, impact, and so on mapped to the alert attributes because alerts also have fields like severity and rating and so on. So you can map these. Um, and also um, you can see that the, in the technical details we have a specific tab here. So you can see the alert details, alert category, manage object type and uh, name, rating, priority. So these were coming from, uh, from SAP. These, these are the properties of the solution manager alert. And you also have the metrics here. Well, this, this is very simple metric because it's just a flag that it was uh, not, not available. So let's go back uh, to the incident. Uh, forgot to show you the notes which actually contain all the metric and other details uh, from solution manager and also you get all the descriptions so whatever descriptions you've maintained in solution manager will be added here um, let's jump back to the incidents and see what else we have here for example this uh, not, a not enough dialog resources if you go there you can see that uh, we can have even links to SAP transactions. So if you open this in a new window, you can sign into a uh, SAP transaction and take either immediate action or at least uh, figure out what's going on. So this is again a very useful feature for the alert-based uh, uh, incidents.